and welcome to the Thorpe Park Resort. Hey, we have uh, been here all day uh, on park riding some coasters, but it got nice and wet and drizzly. So we went to the pub, but now we are back for the VIP press launch of The Walking Dead The Ride. And we're pumped, we're really excited. Hannah, you love The Walking Dead. He's back again. <laughs> Uh, you love The Walking Dead. <laughs> He's been a menace. Yeah. Uh, I absolutely love The Walking Dead. I'm completely up to date uh, with everything that's going on with The Walking Dead and I absolutely love it. Mikey doesn't watch it. I've he never actually watched The Walking Dead. He loves Dead. zombies, he loves horror, but doesn't have time for a series. <laughs> but I absolutely love it and I'm hoping to see some really good references to Negan and the, the saviours in there because they're my favourite part of Walking Dead at the minute. Yeah, um, well we've been in the park like we say, we've seen the entrance to say that it, it looks really cool. It looks really exciting, they're just putting the finishing touches on. Uh, whilst we were in there. So, like we say, we're here for the VIP press launch uh, of The Walking Dead. It opens this weekend uh, to the general public. Uh, ready for Easter, happy Easter. Uh, so we're gonna go on in now. I think we've got some food, some drinks first. Uh, we're gonna meet up with the Scare Tour gang. There's Yay! loads of other fan sites here as well, so it'd be cool to see those guys. Uh, and then we'll take you for the ride. I think we get to ride some other dark, uh, dark rides tonight as well. So we've got a few coasters I hope so. I hope so. in the dark. It's been off all day, so I kind of like it if that opens, but it's, I know it's had issues with the weather, um, but I know that I absolutely love Nemesis in the Dark, so fingers crossed. Yeah, awesome. Right, we'll see you in a bit. Bye. So we've just got in. We have got our little wristbands on. We all let's have a look. There we go, we've got our press wristbands on. Now we're on our way to the dome, uh, so I'm quite excited. Uh, there's not too many people here yet, but we don't know, it might get a bit busy there's later. There's not many yet, but the, the guest list did look quite large. The guest list looked pretty big, so yeah. So I'm excited, we're gonna go into the dome, have something to eat, have a drink, and then we are gonna go on in and ride The Walking Dead. Who's over there? Oh, <laughs> look at these friendly faces. In May, towards May. Andy Porter and uh, Nick Hudson, see you in a bit. into the queue line for the Walking Dead The Ride. Uh, we just had a quick go on Darren Brown's Ghost Train, which was running well. Uh, so yeah, Hannah, are you excited? I am really excited. I think it looks so good. Yeah, so just to show you guys, without making you dizzy, uh, we're now in the safe zone. The Thorpe Park safe zone. And they've got a nice big watchtower there, just with this nice big queue here. Um, so yeah, we're looking forward to it. We're gonna get on. Um, We've heard some good things that people have already been on it. Uh, like we say, we didn't want to come here straight away. Uh, we wanted to get on it after it's, you know, bedded in a little bit. Yeah, you've got to get through the, the first couple of teething problems. So we sort of left it a bit. We stayed in the bar a bit, bit longer than we probably should have. Um, still got a bit of wine though. Uh, and then we were headed over to Dylan Brown's Ghost Train, which I think was running. Hey, hey Michael Bolton. <laughs> Hello. Uh, I think it was running better this evening than it was uh, this morning. Yeah. Um, so that was good. I really enjoyed the VR on that. Uh, and now we're here. We're heading into this uh, estimated 45 minute queue, which for uh, sort of press night is not that bad. That's right, yeah. Michael's here from Skirtle. So, Michael, you've already done this ride a few weeks ago. Yeah. Did you enjoy it? I did actually. I'm really looking forward to seeing it with all of the uh, effects completely working and completed. It's going to be fun. Yeah, awesome. Right, so let's get on. Uh, we'll show you a little bit. <laughs> we'll show you a little bit of the queue line as we go around and then we'll let you know uh, how we enjoyed it when we get off. But before you can enter the safe zone, you need to answer three questions. You at the back. How many walkers have you found? We need to move them to the bunker now. Huh? They haven't been questioned yet. Look, Negan is on to us for more supplies every day. We need the help. We don't know who these people are. Yeah, we're moving power. Walkers are picking up fuel tanks for the generator. Yeah, screw the questions. I'm letting you in. Look, I need this system when it's not my head. Hold tight and do not get out until you reach the cafeteria unload them. There's a tunnel there that you can escape from. <laughs> Got 
cheeky sand cousins here. Hello, you enjoy the ride? Yes, very much so. Yeah, it was yes, good. Thought I it think, was fantastic. Yeah, far yeah, better than I thought it was going to be actually. It was uh, and longer than I thought it was going to be yes, actually. Yes, yes, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, I'm glad you liked it. Thank you. Thanks, <laughs> back to Hannah. <laughs> back to Hannah in the studio. Hi. Uh, um, yeah. So um, what I like about it is that they've now made the queue line near enough all outdoors. Yeah. Uh, so it's all queue line there. There will be some indoors when it's on busier days, obviously. But they've kind of made the whole old queue line just themed. So you go in, there's a pre-show element. I'm not going to tell you much about it. It's not an extravagant pre-show like Wicker Man was. Or no. It's just a standard watch something, learn something, and go, that's why we're here. And then, But yeah. when you went through, it didn't feel like X, did it, at all? No, not at all. Yeah. I mean, the first walkthrough with the corridors, it felt very similar to X, if you know the layout and you've done it quite a few times. But, but it, it was well themed. It, it felt very different, and the theming, um, it was Walking Dead. It's the best way to put it is that it was, yeah. it was, it was spot on. I yeah, it was really spot on theming. And then uh, throughout, there's some good sounds, some good smells, the visuals. It all feels, like I say, the same layout, uh, but very it, its own attraction, completely its own attraction. Yeah. Um, I liked the little nods as well, like a couple of crates said, like, property of Negan, and there was, like, a checklist of yeah. things that they had to send to the Saviour. So I liked, like that it was The Walking Dead, not just a zombie maze. Yeah, totally. Uh, and then the ride, uh, obviously it's the same layout. It's, it, it is just a retheme of X. Close is the same. They've brought back the sort of stalling, sort of juddering bits. I really liked um, that but bit. But they made it part of a story. Mm. And we don't want to give too much away because we want you guys to enjoy. Don't go on there thinking, best, amazing, multi-million pound coaster it's ever. It's still X. It is it still X with an but amazing theme. And they've changed, great theme. they've changed the layout. I think they've added an, an extra extra break running. I think Feels it, it like felt it. like there was another one. Uh, it doesn't go backwards like it did a couple of years ago, but I really, really enjoyed the new additions and the fact that the break runs were used as part of a story. Yeah, absolutely. And there was a, like a, not a soundtrack on your car, but at each sort of break run, there was a soundtrack of what's happening, why yeah. it's happening, how it's going to help you get you out. Uh, so yeah, it was really quite enjoyable. I liked it and I'm definitely looking forward to coming back and riding it again. Yeah, totally. So we're going to do a few more rides, uh, but thank you for watching this Scarecam vlog. Uh, if you are listening to the episode, oh, we got Sarah we got Cousins, Sam. Sarah, Sarah Cousins. as well. No, nice. we, got, we got Sam, nice. Sam Cousins, Timothy Deves. Uh, let's speak, let's speak to, uh, to Tim, yeah, uh, Tim got, and like, Sarah. Uh, <laughs> how did you enjoy? Uh, how did you enjoy The Walking Dead? Yeah, it's really good. Thanks. I really liked some of the special effects. They did some really cool things with lights and sound and screens and yeah, really okay. impressive. And Sarah, you enjoy it? Yeah, it's good. It's, yeah. it's quite scary yeah, sometimes, wasn't it? it? Yeah. Because you didn't know what you were expecting, but it was scary. Oh, sweet. So uh, we're actually one person down at the moment. Mr. Michael Bolton's gone round again because they're going to film him. So we'll try and find the footage for that. Yes. Because oh that is oh, going to be hilarious. Them, I thought they were just interviewing. Uh, so um, yeah. So who knows? So I think that brings us to the end. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to listen to the podcast as well, scaretrack.podbean.com. Uh, and from all of us here at uh, <laughs> Thought Park Press Night for The Walking Dead. See you later. Bye. See you guys.